I'm Angela Godwin with Waterworld and Industrial Waterworld magazine coming to you from the Blue Tech Forum in San Francisco, California. I am very pleased to be joined today by Sally Gutierrez. She is with US EPA and we are so honored to have you with us, Sally. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you, Angela. It's great to be here. Well, you know, with your your work with the clusters program um, has made it so that your name is synonymous, I think, <laughs> with um, fostering innovation and, and, and bringing new technology to market. Why do you think it's important for EPA to have a role in providing a path for these new technologies? So we have a lot of very um, important water problems to solve in this country and elsewhere in the world. And to make progress in resolving those problems, we really have to embrace new technologies. Mm -hmm. That's how we solve these problems. So we have a direct role in supporting uh, the development of technologies, research in, these, in this area, and to work with the private sector toward that common end of having a better world. Yeah, absolutely. And actually, that ties in with my next question. You know, we hear a lot about barriers to new technology, that um, there are some regulatory issues there that, that seem to um, prohibit some companies from coming to market. Um, what, do you, what is EPA trying to do there to help alleviate that, that burden? So I think, as, uh, as we know from the sector, it's very fragmented. It's a tough area. Uh, for innovation in in many respects, not across the board, but in many respects. And I think the real key to uh, making progress is through this cooperation. Mm -hmm. And the cluster uh, model is shown to be a model very effective for understanding where you might have issues around uh, progress mm -hmm. in the development of these technologies and you have an approach that is cooperative to identify whatever those barriers are at whatever those levels are mm -hmm. and to work toward that common end and EPA is very much uh, on board with trying to support initiatives around uh, you know decreasing these barriers and to really foster this uh, spirit of cooperation mm -hmm. so that we can all benefit and at the end we have safe and clean water. Absolutely, which is the most important thing at the end of the day, right? Absolutely. Well, you bring up collaboration and I'm glad because I wanted to talk more about that. It, it does seem in the last few years, five years or so, um, EPA has really made a, a very concerted effort to be more collaborative and more um, engaged, I guess I would say, with, with their stakeholders, right? Um, how do you feel like that's being received and, and where yeah. do you think it's headed? So I just feel that, uh, you know, the agency has always uh, had programs in place and so many initiatives that really have been around cooperation, collaboration, trying to advance the mission of the, of the agency mm -hmm. in terms of protecting human health and the environment. But I think during the last five to six years, we have really taken that to a, to yeah. a new level. Yeah. And we've come out with a technology, a water technology blueprint, innovation mm -hmm. blueprint for the first time. Uh, we uh, supported the launch of the, of the clusters program over mm -hmm. that time, again, all around collaboration and, uh, and cooperation. And I think for the agency, we have really begun to um, even take on much more personally. You know, we have investments in early stage companies that we've yeah. begun to recognize, I think, more fully during this time. We've begun to be much more serious mm -hmm. about spinning out technologies that are developed by EPA researchers and putting them in the hands of those that can commercialize them, right, in a much more robust fashion than we have ever done wow. in the last five years. So it's an extraordinary time, and I think that uh, we've learned a lot during that time, but I believe the best is yet to come. And I really believe that the progress that we're going to make is really through collaboration and cooperation. Excellent. Well, we wish you all the best of luck with that going forward, right. and we'll keep an eye on that, too. All right. So thank well, you, Sally. It'll be good. Thank you very much for your time. All right. Thank you, Angela. For Waterworld Magazine, I'm Angela Godwin. All right.